The Kenya Port Authority says although Uganda provides the largest amount of business in terms of transit cargo off the seas through its facility, unclaimed goods worth billions of shillings will continue to attract fines. We can be able to clear through the port of Mombasa within four, five days and leave without paying any storage at all. But what we tell our stakeholders and our customers, don't wait for your cargo to land. It stays for two weeks before you start the clearance process. But the Uganda Clearing Industry and Forwarding Association maintains that punitive levies on transit cargo destined for the hinterland through Mombasa has continuously discouraged their members from clearing. And those are the problems we are having in the port of Mombasa. They are reducing the grace period by the day. For example, the grace period was uh, 14 days. They have now reduced it to nine days. And uh, that means you start paying storage even before. The, and yet they are handling terminal handling charges. There are a number of uh, port, uh, port charges which we pay. Uh, we pay wharfage. We pay a number of other charges. We think those should compensate for the period that you, we get as a grace period. During a meeting in Kampala, Kenya Port Authority officials announced a series of improvements in cargo clearance, a move it says should retain and strengthen business with local importers. We have started the second container terminal, capable of handling 1.2 million TUs. We have completed a new BAT, BAT 19, capable of handling around 200,000 TUs in a year. We have improved our efficiency. Early this year, Tanzania announced a raft of incentives to Ugandan imports to reach Dar es Salaam port, which included a goods share to be used at no cost for a week, wagons to move cargo via rail to Mwanza, and land to build a terminal. Only yesterday, Kenya's president, Uhuru Kenyatta, ordered does directed that movement of transit goods from the port of Mombasa to Malaba should be reduced to a maximum of five days. Reina Ojan. NTV Weekend Edition.